Alright, so what I'm going to be doing is I'm going to be going AFK for just a moment while this loads. And I'll be right back. Well, I was going to head out, but I think uh, it may not be responding. Okay. Is that letting me alt tab back in for some reason? And the uh, little preview window doesn't match what I can bring up here, so I'm thinking it crashed. Because it was all, trying to all tab out. Alright. Give me one second. Actually, I'll just throw this up. Oh my god. I am so sorry this is so disorganized. But, welcome back, everyone. Oh my god. See, this is why I'm not a professional. I myself am very non-professional. I'm just waiting for it to pop back up. I'm going to just switch it to I'm going to try and switch it preemptively to the uh here we are cuz I see it loading. Yeah. Yay, I did something right. Okay, so it's going to be loading up in just a moment. Um, it's going to first go to the title screen. Oh my god. I'm sorry, everything's so disorganized. I haven't actually been on RP first in a while. Alright, now I'm going to go AFK.
All right, here we are. I also decided to launch it in uh, low memory, so it should only take four gigabytes of RAM for uh, it to process anything or anything it needs to. Look at how much sm smoother this is. See, just need a reboot. And they're heading off to King's Landing, so I might be able to catch up to them. Well, no, they're probably at King's Landing already. As long as they didn't run into uh, too much trouble on the way there. Ooh, a little bit of stuttering there. I wonder what that was about. Don't have time for sabers. There is the water's edge that I was looking for. Alright, so... In the course of two days, the lands of Westeros have decided to go absolutely nuts. You got the royal family just executing people. You've got disappearances. And I don't know about any of this in character. Everything was all good. Passably good. And I was going to make help things improve. I was looking to mediate the situation between the Baratheons and the Targaryens, but I believe that might not be possible anymore. At least okay. I don't know who that was, but they're very, very bright. Very vibrant. Okay, what was that all about? Who knows? Who cares? The server population is rather high. And there will be places where there are a ton of... Uh, structures. There we go. Ooh, that's a, that's a decent sized bridge. All right, I gotta go. <laughs> no more excuses to delay because I'm trying to let things pop in. <laughs> I gotta just go. No! Don't knock me off my horse. Don't stun me. Go away. Crap. Crap. Big lumbering camels, trikes, rocks that just pop in out of nowhere. All working against me, but I will get there. Eventually. Hello, Lord Tentacle. How are you? I guess this is Tentacle Lord. My eyes just kind of like did the whole dyslexia thing.
This is a big, nice, open, flat area. You doing good? Great. I wouldn't say I'm doing perfect, but I've had some good moments and bad moments today. My day is certainly going a lot better than some people. How am I doing? Well, I'm doing a lot better than the Baratheons are. Do you hear about what's going on with them? Oof, that was actually a rough landing. Well, we are one less Baratheon. As of yesterday, maybe two nights ago. It might be two nights ago now. I miss it. I think I missed my turn. That stutter means I can only be getting closer to King's Landing. <laughs> One of the Baratheons uh, was executed. Uh, for me, it was like last night. Come on. There you go. This one in King's Landing was like right over here. What is that place? Cranog folk. Oh, hey, there was supposed to be that like that thing that happened that was supposed to be here. Uh, why? Uh, they were accused of high treason. Whether they actually commit high treason or not is anyone's guess. But uh, the trial. Okay, I don't know any of this in character. I don't even know that any of them died yet in character. But, from the way the trial played out, they knew they were going to execute the Baratheon before the Baratheon had even showed up. Driftmark? No, it's um the Cranogs. I didn't know that they were here. I'm gonna be honest. So, yeah, so one last night, one of the Brathians was accused of high treason and executed very quickly. Um, not given any kind of real... Uh, the, the trial, if you want to call it that, um, was very, very, very short. You were close to the Bear Village, not where you want to be. Yeah, I... I was actually looking for this bridge right here.
Whoops. We're just gonna blame that on me being a bad navigator. There we are. Oh, the queen is in, I see. Well, I see two, maybe. She might be on the other one. Oh my god, all the pop in. All the pop in. Thank you, torches. I think this is them. I was supposed to come in with this group right here, I believe. Yep, this is definitely them. I was supposed to come in with Koro's... Oh my god, those are vibrant. I don't know the pin code, but you know what I do know? That you guys have flares right here that you... Okay. <laughs> I know you have flares right here. Fuck. <laughs> All right. Is this? No, that's not one of ours. Sugar plum. I'm looking for kittens. Cause kittens not gonna mind. Hi, Shadow. Do you have any stone? <gasps> you have stone, but you don't have flint, do you? Spark puff either. That's not very helpful. I'm wondering if they if any of them have flint. Like any of ours have flint. You just need like five flint or something. Oh maybe. Whoa. Okay. Don't need any of that. Flint. Nope. Wait, that's mine. Flint? Flint. No flint. No spark powder either. Does no one carry flint anymore? Flint! I will take all of your flint. And some of your stone. Back over to mine. Uh, anything good happening? Uh, 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 Tucker's Tucker's awake again. We were just catching Excuse up me. Up That's on, good. Uh, current events. Just getting him caught up on current events. Uh, uh, then Cassandra <laughs> came over, and uh, I guess she's now the lady of I can help you. the veil. Hi. I'm actually supposed so to be uh, here with the others from Jasper the veil. Jasper is dead. Okay. She's taking over until they find him? Or something? I don't know. Go ahead, Sal. I'll close That's the doors. They're sorting out right now, I guess. I think they're here. Uh, yeah, so I took it upon myself. Uh, lag. Why lag? Do we meet before? You look familiar. Mm. Or is that just on hmm? or at least? We perhaps met once. Are you that uh, old guy? I can't remember how to No. We've met two or three here. A shield in front as well. I'm gonna wait to be allowed in. They're up here. Hi, Orpheus. 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 Be long enough. Hi, Orpheus. I'm sorry I'm late. Is Orpheus? Uh, another. 
Okay, important matter. Important person in this. Daldry says you're supposed to be staying with the other children. <laughs> it's never gonna work, is it? Right, every time. <laughs> Oh yeah, okay, it is a lag moment. I was like... <sighs> Can't tell if they're keeping me young or making me old faster. Alright. I would like to write up a letter and I will seal it and give it with you. I would like to at least give a week or two in a search for your Lord Jasper before I formally uh, condone Sandra to be the new lady. I will name her Lady Regent, and in my letter, if a week and a half passes and Jasper is unable to be found, then she will be made full lady. She will still have all of the uh, title that comes along with being a lady. I just don't wish to name her Lady preemptively if Jasper is found. You have a question, Hog. Yes. I wish to search for my lord. I feel very bad that I was uh, asleep. Kidnapping. And... At least two days to search for him. May I speak plainly? Depending on who abducted your lord, I would suggest not going alone. Because if you go alone, you have more of a chance to get yourself abducted, just like your lord. Especially if news comes out that you are second in command of the Vale. Be discreet as well. Um, <laughs> cover my little. Not seeking this coral black with these dreads and death. My shoulder. We're Disguise not asking you not to. That... Very. Mm. We're not asking you to not look for your lord. That is, uh, would never ask a knight who's sworn to a lord to do that. Just take the necessary precautions. That I shall. I shall. Suitable amount of people that can come search every day for right. as long. Please stand, Cassandra. Table, I'm sorry. Uh oh. Please stand here, please. Alright. Would you kneel? Please repeat after me. I, Lady Cassandra. Hi, Lady Cassandra. Hello, Killjoy. I promise to uphold the people of the lands of the Vale. Promise to uphold the. Sorry. Promise to word. uphold the people of the lands of the Vale. Promise to uphold the people. Lands of the Vale. I will be as just and upright a ruler as needed for my people. As just and upright a ruler. 
I swear this by the old gods and the new. I swear this by the old gods and the new. Alright. Please rise, Lady Cassandra. I will uh, have the proper paperwork written up for you so that they know that this is a. Uh, my decision if people come to ask. Can you give me a moment? that we need to uh, go over? Not I it. believe. Just need to wait for the paperwork, that's all. I understand. Okay. Sage, uh, you know what we are doing after this, correct? We shall be going to the stable hand. Be speaking to him. Uh, Sorry, okay. I do not mean to interrupt, but uh, tell him there is someone from the Iron Isles at the front gate asking for you. Why would they be asking for me? That's odd. Dun dun dun! How am I doing? I'm doing. Okay, I guess. It's a uh, a it girl a that came here last woman? night. No, it's a it's a female. She uh last night she oh. was here with someone called Court. She introduced herself as Tysinian's cousin. Tysinian's cousin. Oh well, there's something yes. interesting. And what about you? How are you doing? She's up at the main gate. Mm. I made her wait all the way up at the start. I can't type. <laughs> I think they're all um, tabbed out. So, this is probably the point where we should do all of our talking. I have no idea what they're doing. Announcements. Let's see if there's any announcements. Nope. Nothing came out. Alright. Sorry to keep you waiting. I the paperwork and I'll uh, give you back his will and the uh, what I just ripped up. I could move around to this chair. Oh, she actually was typing. Holy crap. 
that whole time. <laughs> All right. Well, I have fun with it. Certain time or there are times where certain events come up and you're and it's yeah. frustrating to deal with, but it is what it is. There I are have, quite uh, a few people. Any questions or wish to seek any guidance? I did provide some counsel for Lord Jasper. Sorry, what? I'm having oh. really bad headaches. It's all right. Um, I was just saying that uh, I did provide counsel when Lord Jasper wanted it. So if there was ever a time that you wish to have another person to talk to, you're more than welcome to come here. Well, this one is full of people. It usually ranges anywhere between 45 people when it's a bit slow to 100 to 130 well, people okay. on uh, a busy night. Because that really makes me have a headache. <laughs> I'm looking at the floor. It sometimes makes your head feel a little better. Oh, but the floor is so gray. <laughs> between the black and the gray floor. I guess you're correct. It's a little more entertaining now. Yeah, it's a lot of people. Alright, well I wish all of you luck. Hopefully, yeah, if the veil is not in too much Oops. disarray. I'll just uh, push a button to lower my volume, I think. Yeah, okay. Yeah, I think we'll be okay. We gotta look for Uncle Jasper. And hopefully he's all right wherever he's at. Yes, hopefully. Uh, Jasper was the Lord of the Vale, and he is currently missing. Right, let me escort you out of the any doors. So many doors, lots and lots so... of doors, and lots and lots of stairs. In the three pretty dargons. <laughs> you know, I've seen them since I was a little girl. I like the green one. It's pretty. <laughs> the the green one is the one I sat into now. the keep to see when I was a child. I apologize okay. for that, your grace. <laughs> You probably even think Orpheus is a child. Mm-hmm. <laughs> I don't know. I think I'm starting to see. I think I'm starting to see crow's feet around your eyes. Comes with age and wisdom. <laughs> I don't see any crows Are on the his face. Gray hairs oh, that we see old. also coming with wisdom. Let's go. Yes, it also comes with it, but I don't have any gray dreads yet, so. I'm not old. You're so old. You want me to be old? I'm in my late twenties. Well, judge me. All the yeah, judgment is old. happening. Some nights don't even get to see tw their late twenties. Thank you, my lady. Whoa. Of course. Oh. No need for that. I, but if my father, if he was alive, ever heard me not bow to you, I would die. What? Sorry. We missed you. Travel safely. Might be with you. Thank you. Thank you. Seems what, Chet? All right. 
What next um, to do? Have, uh, have you seen a Sirius? I think we need to have that meeting, right? What's he do? Sirius, he is the Knight of Driftmark. Oh, no, I haven't seen him. The uh, woman that you saw talking to us, the one that's, I think, okay. right there. But I um, that might have been her. Have you... That was the queen of the... Uh... Yeah, he was up by the veil, staring off into... Space. Everything on that map. <laughs> he had a dog with, with his dog. With his dog? The Those duty, wyverns uh, are the, the only two. wyverns on the server. And they're actually they're the only like flying the mounts other... on the server. Okay. Alright, uh, thank you. You're welcome. Okay, so... Alright. Oh, Orpheus, before we head off, I have something to give you. Um, can you... Oh, I'll just stuff it in your saddlebag. I took notes. Notes of the meeting? I have one called... The lone stag has been slain by the dragon. Blood spilled below the throne. Back lies. You and Orpheus can Of course I can. Well, Lyra, not really, but. Worry about this. What about me? She's not worried about you. They see. Where are you going, Cora? So, now I know that Tysinian has been killed. Tysinian was who I called the lone stag. Because... Are you gonna talk about things that I should possibly hear? Because I'm a stable hand too, you know. I know you're a stable hand. Relax. Guys, it's moving away from the H. They're not interrupting other people's. So many conversations going on. Jeez. So, the Iron Isles is on what you might call Carnivore Island, or Carno Island. And if you're not familiar with this server, then you probably uh, aren't aware of that. That is a giant sheet of ice that separates the, uh, the, far, the ice biome from the rest of the map. And that is called the Wall. This is Game of Thrones based, so if you know what the wall is in Game of Thrones, that's what that is. You can see it from King's Landing. That's how big it is. And just for reference, there. It's uh, that line just above the... Um... Did you read my note? Yes, I did. Above the uh, 50 latitude or longitude mark. That uh, that river that goes stays between us to, up to the north, that's all walled off. You and I will discuss this in private. All right. For now, let me fill you in on what I know. We have learned of the Seven Kingdoms of Jasper's disappearance, but it looks very grim, and I did not want to say that in front of Cassandra. There was so much blood. So much. When I was up at the wall, I overheard, um, I believe he's first steward. I was talking to one of the initiates, saying that the Night King is active. That means it's the end of season event. Koro then told me later on about what I wrote to you in that note about. I am taking the role of ranger captain for a lot of reasons right now. But we have to keep the veil neutral no matter what. Lifted. No, I understand. But I will always do whatever the Lord of Light wills me to. Of course, that's a lie. And I feel a sudden pull in a direction that I'm scared of. I'll confide in you for that later. Very well. For now, I need to take care of Cassandra. 
Jasper is named me third in line. That means if her or Koro, something happens to them, I have to take over the veil. That sounds like a tedious task. We need to recruit more people. There's barely anyone awake these days. And really, it's just us. Those who you've already seen. Hmm. Did Roland really take that many when she left? Roland was our builder. Uh, she... Roland. Thomas and Evelyn left in a, an angry fit when they lost their stewardships. I figured that would happen. I see. Remember how I had to yell at people the other day? Didn't end well for them. Keeping the rest of the party. I don't know, but it was a bit noisy back there. Yeah, I need some quiet. You usually let me talk and you uh, just listen. So I figured coming to see you would be the best option. As you know, I always offer counsel to any who need it. I know. That is Lyra Stonetree. I need a lot of that. The daughter... I'm just need you. The daughter of... Valak is going to be asleep for a long time. Of course now she is. is uh, the time to make yourself known and... Help out Cassandra as much as possible. Show her the Lord of Light. Shh. Valak isn't very good at showing <laughs> it to people. He only really shows the shadows and he's very cold. I think you could help show her the light, the warmth. What you showed me. I'll do my best. And if the Lord of Light sees fit, I'll succeed. That is Lyra Stonetree. She is the daughter of Myron Stonetree, who is the Knight Captain of Winterfell. I think he's with you. The Lord of Light is with us all. Sometimes I question if he's with me. There will come a time when you will no longer need to question. Feels like I keep losing everyone. Mothers, often bravos, she doesn't even write anymore. My father won't wake up. Brenna is gone. John is gone. Bale is gone. Now Jasper. I thought you and Jasper would be the two people that would stay. I don't see why they wouldn't be able to. Sorry, your voice is. I couldn't hear you. Lyra? Hmm. Is everything okay? Uh, yeah, everything's fine. Yeah. 
Act a little strange, but okay. Uh, just make sure that uh, the lady gets home. Of course. Alright, I will meet you there shortly. Alright, be safe out there. Don't worry, we will return Wait, her before sunset. Go. Make sure she's back before her curfew. Her, her horse turns back into a pumpkin. <laughs> oh, you probably don't even know that fairy tale, do you? Let's go back inside, I guess, and see if uh, she's coming out. I know she saw her aunt. Fairies have tails? Oh dear. You and I are going to have a long talk. I have so many books to show you, it's ridiculous. Oh god. Mag fest again. Because it's <laughs> everything's just gonna pop back in. You shouldn't be. They apologize many times. And it's done with. It's over with. So there's no need to be upset with them. Yeah, hopefully, hopefully he can learn that. Yeah, he still wants to persist and and make them apologize to him, but that's not. I'll it's just simple. Cause more conflict that the veil doesn't. Exactly, but simple. You are his lady right now. You can forbid it. You can forbid him from pursuing it. That's all you gotta do. I'm trusting him. <laughs> it just seems very, um, what's the word? Short tempered? Well, I mean, I've already used underhanded. Hmm, maybe not underhanded. Oh. More like willing to do. No, that's not the right one. Um, either, either way. He just He's hard-headed in his own right. Ah, yeah, that. So judgmental. <laughs> That's that, that word. Words. Yeah. But it's all right. <clears throat> shall we? Uh, shall we head back, my lady? Yeah. Let's, yeah. Uh, let's get you home. Besides, I want to show you the office. Aunt gonna be a long time. Yeah. Considering she's inside, it could be a while. I don't. I honestly don't even know what she's doing there. So. Do you want to stay and let her know where we went? Because I think we're gonna go up and have. I I promised mm -hmm. Coro I'd get you home safe and I wouldn't leave your side. So. Okay. I'm uh, gonna stay to that promise. Well, you know, that is if you keep up, because, uh, troopers, quick! <laughs> Seems a bit slow to me. <laughs> if I had Uncle Jasper in Taurus, I would leave you guys in the dust, like, three times. <laughs> yeah, but you don't. Yeah, but you don't. Maybe. I almost have a 300% speed on my horse, so... Oh! I'm good. Oh. There we go. Jasper tends to invest everything into uh, speed, by the way. I actually had to let go of my shift key so I could <laughs> turn and not hit all the trees in the way.
could have sworn I was ahead of her. Oh my god, why do you do that? I hate it when people do that shit. King's saying equals lag kingdom. Yep. Sure does. But yeah, I was ahead of her on my screen, and then all of a sudden... She's gone. So yeah, so we officially have been told that Tysinian has been executed. Um, we haven't been told as to why, we don't know how. Um, just that the dragon has killed the lone stag. The lone stag referring to Tysinian. Uh, it's a nickname he earned when everyone believed his father was dead. We know that's false now. And the dragon referring to, of course, the Targaryen line, so Daenerys. Or at least her kingdom that's killed her. Or not her kingdom, her house. So... Is there any uh, rules on red priests dating other people? As far as I know, there isn't. But that's... The... Uh, the thing about the red priests is that the order is not very united. They're kind of separated. Um, you have some red priests who believe in one thing. You have others that believe, believe in another. You have some that are trying to do... Uh, what they believe is good and help out who they believe should be helped out and you have others that are liars, tricksters, and thieves. Some can cast actual magic, some just kind of allude to being able to cast magic. Uh, there's actually a stark difference between me and Valak. Valak is all about warning people of the darkness, warning people of the shadow. You need the Lord of Light because the darkness is coming. The darkness is coming. Move. Whereas uh, Orpheus here is more about the light. You know, help people out because it's the right thing to do. The light, Lord of Light is telling me to help people. Tells me that I should do what I can to make the place brighter. Bring out the best of us. So there's probably some red priests who say you can't uh, date other people, or maybe even you can't date outside the order. And there are others that probably have multiple partners. Um, a good reference to this would actually be, look at Melisandre. Melisandre has slept with how many people? She's a red priestess that's been to Lys and Ashai, and then you have Quaith, who no one knows anything about, but she's been to Ashai as well, and they act, ex they act almost like polar opposites sometimes. So, meh. As far as the whole dating thing goes. But I also want to point out, there's supposed to be a rule saying that the uh, maesters aren't supposed to have, uh, aren't supposed to get emotionally, or not emotionally, but uh, romantically involved. Aren't supposed to have, um, not supposed to get married or have offspring. That's right, you stay back there. I'll take my chances with the scorpion over here. But that's what I was saying, you know, the maesters aren't supposed to get romantically involved, they aren't supposed to get uh, 
not supposed to have children, they're not supposed to get married, but you see that all the time on this server. So, there's also not supposed to be any women in the Night's Watch. I believe the current Lord Commander is a woman. So that tells you how progressive the server is. Ooh. Oh, there's a castle right next to me, of course. It's probably not one of the major ones, but it probably has a bunch of structures in it that's lagging me out. That's the veil right there. I actually want to build something down here. And maybe wall it off on either side. Okay, where's the... There it is. Okay, so we're almost back home at the Vale. So, yeah. So the Vale loses a Lord and Storm's End loses a Knight. Things aren't looking exactly good for the Kingdoms right now. Oh, I think I caught up to her. I think that's her horse right up there. I think she's having as much trouble as I am with the lag right now. There's supposed to be a tower right in front of us. Oh, there it is. <laughs> oh god. Gotta wait for it. I'm the only one that caught up. Actually, I think uh, I was ahead of you at one point and then you slipped past me while I was looking over my shoulder. Which is actually true. <laughs> Where are the others? I decided not to wait for them. Actually turned around, went back to see you guys were actually following me. Well, I knew where you were going, so I thought I'd try to cut you off at the head. Nope, no cutting off trooper. He likes to climb. My horse is a little faster. Oh god, where is she? Yeah, my screen went black. Not the one I'm playing on, the one that has the chat on it. So...
That is a cool looking hound. I don't know if that's paint or not, but it looks cool. <laughs> I don't know why I did that then. Let me uh, tab out and see if I can see what's going on. See if I can see what you posted. Hope it doesn't crash because I'm tabbing out. But my bot is on this computer. It should be on that one, actually, in hindsight. Is it the console? Yeah, I think it's the console that doesn't. All right, show me the chat. Watch it just die immediately. I would laugh. Did the lag ever get fixed? Uh, oh, it's because you put fixed dot, uh, wait, and it thought that was an, uh, URL for whatever reason. For the next episode of Lag of Thrones. Alright, so, looking back at the note, oops. And I pushed I, but it may have... Okay. Okay, so. Oh, it wasn't that one. It was the... Uh... Yeah. K is the orbital cam, if you didn't know. I think everyone in my chat knows that by now. I think everyone plays Ark. Alright. It says, uh... The Lone Stag, who is uh, Tysinian has been slain by the dragon. So, slain by a Targaryen. He was killed by Targaryen. Blood spilled below a throne of lies. So he was killed inside the throne room, probably executed. <laughs> but, uh, let's, let's not leave that just sitting around for anyone to find it. Let's go put that away. Rip. <laughs> I fucking love having one of those as a red priest. Oh my god. L let me show you what, like, ten minutes of farming did with that. Alright, so we're gonna put... It. Yeah, that's a very helpful note, isn't it? All right. <laughs> so they went to King's Grave and there was an emergency. Let's just put that in there and let's lock this up. Wait, are you awake, Cassandra? She's uh concentrating for a moment. Lost oh. in her thoughts, as it were. We get a little bit turned Lost around. Nah, I get her. Here we go. Out of that stuffy armor. But it feels good to take that off. It looks so heavy. Eh, I don't like it. But I'm a southerner through and through. I don't like the cold, I don't like being stuffy. I like airy clothing. I like... 
I'm the opposite. I was born in Winterfell, so the cold is in my veins. Even though I grew up in King's Landing. I've traveled quite a long ways. As long as I'm fully covered, I don't mind. Yeah, I've been living in Dorne a long time. Um, quite a just uh, light airy clothing or, you know, a little bit more skin showing. I grew up in a shy. Skin showing meant skin missing. Fair enough. You seem to be in one piece. All of me that matters. <laughs> Can do like something creepy on. You know, Orpheus, I did see a couple campfires not far from here, hidden uh, behind some trees and rocks. I want to go investigate that later. <laughs> Alright. I need more rangers, though. It can't just be me. I'm gonna have to get at least the Klaus to start waking up more. That sounds like something that needs to be discussed later. Oh, it is. I'm calling that meeting in the, uh, the rangers guild room office thing. <laughs> or I guess my office now. Is the desk shiny, at least? The shiniest desk I've ever seen. <laughs> <laughs> I know you don't know much about my uh, childhood Orpheus, but as a child, I used to always sign my letters, Lyra Stone Tree, Future Ranger. Now it'll be Lyra Stone Tree, Ranger Captain of the Vale. It's uh, fulfilling a pretty big dream. Congratulations. Thank you. I wish Jasper was here to appoint me himself. It was going to be officially done in a couple of days. Previous um, ranger captain uh, left the veil. So I was going to take up his mantle, but... Um... With how secure the veil is, and the others waking up, I would imagine that people would be clambering for a place inside our walls. Yes, agreed. If that happens, you shouldn't have any problem. You shouldn't have any problem keeping the roster full. No, I think it's that going on? I'm just trying to keep it on the down low that I know about that because I don't know if the Night's Watch is 100% confirmed that or not. So you're uh, <sighs> speaking of the cave? I'm cave? speaking of uh, them saying today cave. when. Yeah, I didn't hear anything about a cave. I heard something a little bit more uh, scary. And I was up there I telling, trying to, uh, maybe? 
it's what's in the cave that concerns me. Yep, we're talking about the same cave. Night King? I, I didn't, they didn't say anything about a cave when I was like, when I was trying to get help when I first discovered Jasper's hat, I walked in on them saying the Night King is active. Well, uh, I just heard reports from Daniel uh, at the Night's Watch saying that uh, on one of their scouting missions in the north, they found the cave of the Night King uncovered, usually precludes uh, activity. Yeah. Well, then I, that confirms it enough for me. Yep. Well, yep. Well, like you said, Orpheus, that will bring people here. There will always be a safe haven for those who need it. That's why I have to keep all the lanterns lit. For Jasper, we're supposed to be a light in the dark. You guys have more fireworks uh, to go? That kept everything pretty well lit. <laughs> I'm pretty sure we have tons of fireworks left. <laughs> Worked my fingers to the bone making all of that spark and gunpowder for Jasper. <laughs> yep, yep. Shame we missed it though, Orpheus. But, like, you had, uh, well, you and I had lots to discuss on the Lord of Light, so. It was okay to go I'm missing, I think. I certainly hope so. <laughs> Though the light of the veil did seem rather upset when we arrived. Light of the Veil? I wonder if she's going to say it. Oh, I'm sorry. Somebody say something? I uh, had a headache. Uh, I was just curious uh, about the Light of the Veil. Oh, the Light of the Veil? I suppose Orpheus means Jasper? He has the Light of the Veil. Ah, I see. <laughs> what would you call me as an Orpheus? I am curious. Besides a liar stone tree? You mean what I would call you normally? Yeah, I want a fancy title too. Do you know what I mean? You always have those fancy titles for people. I think something simple such as Wolf of the Veil vale would fit you well. <laughs> Don't lead to me as a child, I used to wear a wolf hat all the time. Even in King's Landing, I was still a Winterfellian. Pretty good title, I must say. <laughs> if you like it. I'll just call you Big Red. <laughs> <laughs> it's certainly better than intimidating. You don't intimidate me. We've talked about this before. I'm not working against the Lord of Light. I'm not, uh... I have no fear of the shadows. And since he works through you, I have nothing to worry about. Welcome back, Cassandra. Hey, Cass. 
What's going on? <laughs> just chatting for you? while they're waiting for you. Mm-hmm. Oh. Did uh, Koro and Sage come back? No, I haven't seen them yet. Okay. I really wanted to talk with all of them. Or both yeah. of them there too. You know how two young kids are. <laughs> oh, young kids. Coral's an old man. <laughs> what? Coral's what? Yeah. Yeah. An old that man. Old. <laughs> mm -hmm. Hey, he Coral. thinks me and Cassandra are babies. Isn't he like 29? Yeah, he is kind of old. Hey. <laughs> to see? <laughs> see? How old are you, Fenwick? I'm only 23. Exactly. He's old. Orpheus is <laughs> everlasting. That's his age. <laughs> Red priests get to stay around a long time. Yes. Sometimes not even death can take us from this world. That's a scary thought. Certainly not in your case. Mm, people are showing there up. There she is. Hey, there's a little turd. What? Mm hmm. The mm -hmm. keep. We didn't know how long you'd be. I turn around. I didn't realize they shut the doors on me. I just went to go look at a horse, and I was coming right back. And I turn around, and the doors are closed. And I tried to get them to open them, and it was it was a hassle. Um, we have a lady here uh, looking for Maester. Um, he's awake. We're right back. Mm-hmm. Why is she seeking a maester? Thank you, Fen, for keeping her safe. I'm not sure. I just uh, brought her up. That's all. I saw her down there looking at signs, and she said she was looking for a maester. Crystal Manor. I see. So, um, how is everyone up here? Not bad. Well... I mean, we awake. could be worse. Considering... Oh, you yeah. never say that, that's when it does get worse. <laughs> I know. However, if you need a red priest, I'm here. I don't know if a red priest could help, so... I'm not familiar with such... well, not a lot of things, so... You could possibly help, I'm not quite sure. What is it you need? Um... More medical or anything, so... Did, did you say hmm. medical? Yeah, medical. Kinda. Kinda. Oh, thing. Orpheus, there you go. He, uh, he, he mended my leg after I fell off the veil. Put it that way. Didn't want to run right up to her and... That you did talk a lot. Off the... But trust me, he gave me a hug the other day. So he's just a little mm -hmm. kid yet. You fell off the veil. That's terrifying. Uh-huh. That is horrifying. I jump yeah. off all the time. This is my first... It's different when you're on a terror bird. I was on my old horse. Oh my god, that poor horse. It's still oh. alive. What? Now, I gave him over to you. Like a, a magical horse. Where did you put that horse, Orpheus? It's yours now. Oh yeah, she's right here. <laughs> 
<laughs> this is him. right next to you. I wasn't looking. Yeah, this is the horse that survived it. All the way from a... Well, just uh, outside of those gates. I went off the edge. I wasn't used to coming up and down yet. We've been here like two days. So down I went. You'd rather talk about woke in up in the swamp. Ah, uh, yes. Alright. Journey, journey, here I will like my horse or just leave it. So, how are things? I think it should be safe there lazy. for now. <laughs> okay. I do have speed investment, by the way. This should be far enough, or far enough from them, so uh, we'd have a little bit of privacy. How can I help? Okay. Um, well, I was suggested to come see the maester here, um, because I recently had... Don't panic. Okay, just don't panic. I had a case of grayscales a year ago, but I got it treated, and it no longer spreads or can pages of any it as you can tell on the side it, my bangs are hiding most of it but um all of the infection area i don't like it and i was wondering if there's a chance to heal the muscle or um, the flesh or the skin of it to i guess recover can be recovered of it but that makes sense Hmm. I have to admit, it's not something I've ever treated before. And something just falls. So it's something I would definitely have to uh, look into. Converse with some of the older uh, priests to see what they have to say about it. My aunt is a red priest and they tried looking into it but they couldn't figure out anything so it's... I've seen grayscale before but never treated it's very very uh, rare for people treated most people end up getting murdered or exiled I guess I was just one lucky one second here it haunts me still. I imagine so. Believe me, I can relate. I'll do what I can. Uh -huh. I'll talk to the maester here. And some of the uh, red priests here, and perhaps even in King's Landing. See if I can't find an answer for you. It's not a problem. Is there anything else I, I can do to help? Return tomorrow. Mm, not to my knowledge. No. I might return tomorrow though and see if the maester is here as well. Just see if he knows anything. I'll be sure to uh, talk to him. Um, my name is Lauren. Lauren Zeus. I am Morpheus. Nice to meet you, Morpheus. Oh, thank you. Um, uh, grayscale, grayscale, grayscale yeah, can be treated. That's my knowledge, all I wanted to talk about was yeah, I don't know. It's really awkward, and a lot of people uh, when they hear grayscale, they panic. So I don't want people panicking. Thinking I'm contagious because I'm not contagious or anything. I'm good. Yeah. And as soon as you said it had been a year, I knew you weren't contagious or that it was spreading. After that much time, 
You turn That's into uh, those abominations by the ocean. Great Stale takes more than a year. It takes like several years. For some. For most. Probably. Really uh, bad when the sick are working on the sick, so... Well, fortunately for you, I'm not sick. <laughs> Fortunate for me. But I will do everything I can to, uh, look into the matter. Um, I currently reside on the Iron Isle, so if you ever need <laughs> Ally should be there. I see. I have been meaning to go to the Iron Isles. And you said that oh. the... Uh, yes, I was told that uh, they're not exactly friendly to Red Priests. I know nothing of it. I just arrived, so, recently. Mm. The Ironborn of the Iron Isles believe in the Drowned God. They view my religion as blasphemous. I was promised I to be drowned as soon as I arrived. Oh. Uh -huh. I'm very open-minded with religions and such, so. Uh, a lot of uh, families of different types of things, so I'm very open to everything, which is probably really, in most cases, most people mind, especially whatever happens, happens. Nice. So if I find anything out, I'll uh, try to get words to you as soon as I can. No problem. I only do what I must for the Lord of Light. May the light guide you. And may the Lord of Light watch over you. Bad things happen on the Arnals. I'll let you uh, do as you must or but I've been doing it before because it seemed like I was interrupting. And there's a few important talks that have to be had amongst the uh, people of the Vale. I'm not sure if I'm at liberty to discuss them beyond that point. Understandable. Um, so yeah. Thank you. Of course. Hope you have a good day. You as well. I have a reason to visit the Isles. Actually, the whole reason I want to go to the Iron Isles is because I want to question Charlie about what's been going on. And I'm afraid of uh, being drowned. <laughs> I'm afraid of them going... A heretic and trying to drown me immediately. Whoa! What? What? <laughs> no. <laughs> oh, come on. Are we rubber banding that hard right now? Are they here? If you didn't know that was a pig, that would probably scare the crap out of you. This was open. Hmm. This was this. 
I don't know where people have gone, but I'll find them. Whoa. Okay. What? It, oh, okay. Final episode, the main character gets drowned. <laughs> yeah. That would be bad. But I, I, I have a plan. Don't you worry about that. Whose horse is this? Well, yes, we already have those. It's going to be our regular items and then whatever else, I guess. Oh, oh, uh... Wait, Allie, will you do something special? Mm -hmm. Of course I'll do something I'm gonna special. I'm actually going to be the first one to put my horse back. Uh, cupcakes of pride. I'll make it veil colors, okay? Okay. Yep. And we even have his favorite ice cream down there, the pistachio ice cream. That sounds yum. Mm hmm Alright, so we have trike burgers with cheese. Uh, Orpheus, cupcakes what do you like Uncle to Jasper. eat? Uh, to be honest, I'm not very picky. Don't say souls. Shh. Oh, how about raptor dogs? <laughs> raptor dogs. <gasps> that sounds good. No. 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 What's wrong Why? with raptor dogs? I know. I killed an alpha you raptor on the way here. Okay, you can do alpha raptor dogs, but not raptor dogs. Alpha, alpha raptor dogs? <laughs> I'll do alpha raptor dogs. <laughs> it's okay. Oh, it's, it's okay. Oh, dear. Hmm. Uh, what about, uh, like, pull the uh, Fionia <laughs> fork or something like that? <coughs> or dodo noodle oh, soup? <gasps> dodo noodle soup. I already soup. have dodo noodle have soup. Have Oh, okay. You're good on that, don't Bronto worry about that. Bronto's dead? Um, Where are we gonna get to Bronto? In my head, head, apparently. Head. Yeah, they're not from here. Whoops. <laughs> what about Listro sausages? Mmm. Ew. <laughs> ew. Everything what do you mean, so ew? Funny. Ew. Hey, I know exactly what Orpheus, what you'd like. Hmm? Brentwood lemon cakes. I can give her the recipe. Ooh. Perhaps you should. I'll be what back. is it? They, um, it's a recipe that's been passed down from uh, Brentwoods of Winterfell to my family. And then I gave the recipe to Jasper after my mom left for Bravos. They're lemon cakes. With uh, meringue. Uh, They're very good. Uh, okay. I'm not really big on lemon, but that's fine. It's not, not just, what it's about, not for my party. What about Morella Tops <laughs> Chops? Ooh. Morella Tops Chops? <laughs> that's yeah. a mouthful. Well, they're, they're super juicy and... and... Delicious, I hear. All, all that what water. Not like spicy all dodo water. wings. Cassandra, where is? Oh, where she's is in the keep. She just went to the keep to get a, a recipe. Okay. Well. Okay. Just so you know, we have to have a meeting soon, Kaz and I'm... Hello, Ali. Hi. Sorry, we're planning a birthday party. Okay, I'm planning on killing myself right. because, you know, 
This shit is Whoa, what? What? Kill me my head. Nope. I'm just joking. You're not actually gonna do that. Oh. I don't Never baby like cast. Never oh. bad. Uncle Jasper, first off. Uncle oh, Jasper. Oh wow, this is had uh... one stack left. Here. Eat this. I don't know what you put in that, but that's much better Eat than it. what I can make, I'm sure. Besides, even if you did, I could just... I'm not, e I'm not eating this. Okay. I'm not eating this. It, okay, save it for later, but eat it. Did you seriously just give him that. mashed... I'm mashed not eating that. Chill oh my god. Uh, nope. Okay. Nope. I'm gonna keep you guessing on yeah. what I gave him. Mushrooms? No! Oh my... Flowers? Someone just rode in on a horse. Ones. You might want to check obvious. on that. Yes. It's a menu item. Here, I, I can is, always put that Oh, hey, you got your hat on again. Hey. What? Alright, so far what that. we have for the menu. You did earlier. Alright, listen up. Monkeys are. Yeah, dude. What monkeys are. Ahem. 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 Oh, someone's yelling. What? Alright, listen up, Coro. Stop. Move. Move your ass. Move. <laughs> okay. So far, we have trike burger with Don't cheese. Don't say anything about my jaboas. Continue, right. Allie. Trike burger with cheese. <laughs> Alpha raptor uh -oh. dogs. Uh, Marilla tops chops. Spicy dodo wings, and I want to do some kind of veggie kebabs for the vegetarians. Oh, uh, can we have regular kebabs? Is that possible? Yes, I can do non-veggie kebabs. Cool, cool, cool. Is this for Orpheus' birthday? Orpheus, is this for your birthday? No, it's for no this birthday. is for our little lady's birthday. They might yeah, have a birthday on the same yeah, day. It's kind of weird. I mean, you know, it's weird that you just- I just found out you're 15, but it's okay. Oh, you're such a mean little kid sometimes. <laughs> I'll be planning Orpheus's yeah. birthday. Alright, was there anything else? Like side items or drinks or anything you wanted me to make? I have a lemon Lots lime of spritzer. pistachio ice cream. I oh, already have the recipe and I'm on it right now. I'm making it in my pocket. <laughs> no, I'll in make it as soon as I get home. In my pocket. Um... Uh, let me think, let me think, let me think. Anybody, any ideas? Finn? Uh, yes, I have a tremendous uh, idea. Piranha stir fry. What about hot chocolate? Oh, I've never had that. Oh, oh no hot chocolate. We're, we live in the south. We, uh, we can't. Mm. Well, actually, the party's gonna be up here, isn't it? Like the the hill is always cold. Mm -hmm. It's gonna be in oh, Kingsgrave. We're doing it down in Kingsgrave. Right. No, if it's in Kingsley, then something's oh, running on ice tea or something. Ooh, some people Ooh. are a bit loud. Fruit punch! Roll what? Ooh. You want fruit punch? Say it. You don't leave for that birthday party without me. Just saying. Then you better wake your you. ass up to don't get you. to the party. Don't what did you say, <laughs> <laughs> What did you say? Exactly. What did you just say? Wake your ass you don't up. Say that. You don't say that. That's rude. Even if you are a lady now, you can't say that. That's rude. <laughs> <laughs> I'm never rude to you. And you're going to wake my sense, ass up. Uh, piranha you're never rude to her. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> oh, no, I'm never rude to Cassandra. Okay. Never. Mm -hmm. Yeah, sure. Kidding, no, but really, you should wake up that day, because if you don't, I'm leaving you behind. Love you. And I'll go Tell with her, don't worry. Ass, uh... Tell me, wake my ass. She's got me, Coral. Yeah, I'll I go with her, too. Go... It said, wake my ass up. Mm -hmm. I'm just worried about how damn she just cussed at me. <laughs> if she's going to be the lady here, she's going to say a lot more curses. Me. Yeah, and I'm going to curse for her, too. You can learn all the good like, ones from Aunt Allie. Please don't. <laughs> Please don't learn from Mally. Please do not learn from Mally. Uncle Why? Tucker's teaching me how to be mean. What sort of mm -hmm. curses? Mercy. You're talking about the ones that yeah, make skin no, not those type of curses. Oh. Not those kind. 
Never mind then. <laughs> Son of a gun. Fun curses. Mother funner. Mother funner. Yeah. Oh, guys! What the hell just said mother? No, don't you say Nobody. nothing. Don't you say nothing. The gray is, is all grown up. Do I have any flowers on me? Oh no, I don't. God. He's so just, you know, weird because his ears are popping through his hat. But He's still not... wearing Jasper's bloody hat. Fuck you! Uh -oh. What Find the hell? you! Just say uh, Oh god! Did you just, did you just tell Cass, me? Cass, you can't say that! Did you Cass, just tell me you can't that? say that. <laughs> oh my god. Okay. I think that's no. good enough for today, no, Cass. No, no, we'll no, talk no, some no, more no, tomorrow. No. I'm gonna get go now. I love you. Yeah, I, I need to get home. Alright, guys, have fun going home. Be safe. Completely All missing right. the door because uh, I'm walking right, backwards. Be safe. Take care, everybody. Might be with you. Bye, Me too. You Might be well. with everyone. Well. So, uh, okay, you uh, four. riding by uh, we gotta any, have like, Storm's End area. It looked like they were having There's a party. Yeah, let's something. go up to my office. I have a table uh, and everything up there. It's so awesome. It's not your office, it's my office. You're not a ranger captain. No, I don't give a damn. No, I don't give a damn. Look, look right out here. What does it say? Rangers of the Vale, not Knights of the Vale. Change it. You wish I'll change it. I'll change you. You're in my chair. Oh my gosh. Nope. I'm in my chair. So I'm gonna sit with you. Mm hmm. Where's Cass? I don't know. <laughs> Table. Orpheus, you're sitting at the table with us. You're part of this family. Get over here. Come on, Orpheus. She is super Cass, loud. Where are you? Cass, are you okay? Did she go upstairs? Well, was upstairs. Yes. Yeah. Maybe we can overhear something now. Nope. <laughs> I don't know where the hell she went. <laughs> The moment where he turns around slowly and sees Orp is just standing there. Girl, if you don't get out of the damn seat. No, no, I have waited. I have waited eight years to sit in this chair. Oh my gosh, really? One more hour to sit in the chair. Just need to hold the beat. What the heck is Cass? Did you go back inside the key? You can sit right beside me, though. I'm pretty on the side. <laughs> Alright. Play musical chairs while we wait, I guess. No, we're gonna start. I, I don't. Okay. So, first off, everyone knows of our issue with horses. Cass, is that you walking? Cass, if it's you, you can come sit with me and Gerald. Was that Gerald? I was wondering where they Yeah, Jasper willed him to me to look after till he comes back. So I'm gonna look after him.
Cass, where the hell are you? Stop playing. Nowhere. Cass, where are you? Come on. Cass. Really, really need to have this meat. Cass, okay. where are you? I'm just gonna get yeah. See mirrors, it look like there's a bit on the roof right there. One. No, it's not. Lyra's. I don't know where mine is. Actually, I'm now going, where is mine? You know, go sit on the couch, please. Do 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 Huh. Let's just go ahead and close that. That looks odd. There's a window in there. There's a window in there. So you can go down. Oh. Okay then. That wouldn't give anyone anxiety at all for any reason. Oh shit. Ooh, this looks cool. I'm sorry, I just haven't been all over the place. I'm actually looking for a person and uh... <laughs> trying to think of like all the places that are all hidden away. But this is awesome. Especially this part. The whole... Hmm. Can you imagine someone standing on that and then you just use a crossbow or um, a slingshot to break that while someone's standing on it? I don't know where Lyra went, but... I think they're looking for me now. 
I was looking for uh, Cassandra. The um, I think it's supposed to be the new Lady of the Veil. I'm not sure. Never gonna happen. Lyra, Orpheus, where'd you go? Can you please come back? Yes, yeah, sit in the chair. I know you want to. Take, just take, just take the damn chair. Take the damn chair. <laughs> I mean, you do have your clothes on, right? Clothes been on. I've never seen a man out of dress before. Just because I have doesn't mean I want to. Okay, now where the hell is Lyra? Looking for me. Everybody Going stay. To jump off the veil in him. I cannot. My head. Oh my god. Does it animate? Oh, no, it doesn't. I thought it would animate me, like, opening up my, uh, my inventory, but I guess not. I tried. I tried to find her. I give up. This lady, may I have the chair? Sit. Yeah. Lyra's taking forever, and I'm done. It's now or never. No, we gotta wait for Lyra! I'm going to drink myself to death. Oh my... Koro. I can bring you back. Listen here. I've lost so many people. If I lose you two, I'm gonna jump off the veil. And I can bring I'm you back going. too. <laughs> Not if I go Chris Flat. That's true. If he goes Chris Flat, you cannot. No, I did hear something about being able to transfer a consciousness into something like um, a doll. I could do that. Hmm. Did you make Where me the a shit did Lyra go? <laughs> Orpheus, Sage, can you make me Sage, a Jerboa? I don't know. Sage is missing. Well, she's Let's missing. try it! I'm a jump off the <laughs> No, don't you dare. <laughs> Here we go. Lyra! I think more will get done if I just sit here. Okay. You go to the terror house. I don't know where her house is. <laughs> My chair now. Gonna wait for them to come back. <sighs> what the hell? <laughs> Pieces in my chair. They're looking for you, by the way. Oh my god. By the Lord of Light, this needs to stop. <laughs> I think I especially looked badass, like. I'm here in uh, the meeting room! Okay. So you can see the full tusks. Wait. I'm going to fucking... 
<laughs> okay, can everyone sit down? You know what? I'm, I'll just sit down. I don't even care where anymore. I'll sit down. Everyone else no. sit here, Lyra? Lyra, you sit in the chair. Lyra, see. Orpheus, you get up. Okay. Orpheus, you sit in the left chair. And, and I'll sit on the other end, okay? Take your chair, Lyra. <laughs> Take your chair, Lyra. Take your chair, Lyra. Oh Take my your gosh. Chair. Please sit down. Where do you want her to take it? Just <laughs> get all the way to the shy, or maybe the one percent? Take where to where? What? You said you wanted me to take my chair. Sit down and be quiet, please. <laughs> okay. I will sit on the other side. I do not care any longer. Okay. Now. As we all know, Thomas and Evelyn have left the Vale. They have spayed and neutered all of our horses and all of the ones that they had their name tag on. Which is fine. They didn't spay and neuter all of them. Wow, that was loud. They spayed most of the really good ones. The really good red ones. Did yes. anybody well, pray to the gods about that? I already prayed to the gods. Yep. Me and Sage prayed together, and they answered our. Is anything going to be done about that? Yes, they will be getting in trouble, getting talked to, and whatever else. Um, for us, uh, apparently the gods need to have a vote up in the heavens and determine what will happen to us because of their, uh, because of what they did. For everyone. To know, no one is allowed to spade anyone else's name tagged animal. Even if you bred it, even if it's in your line, you cannot do that anymore if it's under someone else's name tag, no matter what. And is that what they did? Mm -hmm. That is what they did. They spade mine. My, my horse was spade. Yes. Hers is spade under her spade name. my hers purple horse. So, that's what happened. Now, what they don't know, which is really bad on their part, is that they made a contract with the Kingsgrave about a horse that they would get, that we give the Kingsgrave, and Kingsgrave got that horse. And that horse that they got can be bred in anyone in the... Anyone in um, Kingsgrave is allowed to ride one and own one, but they are not allowed to breed them and sell them. They can be bred just strictly for riding purposes only, not to be sold. The contract is with the veil. There is no loop. The, the way you said that was confusing. <laughs> okay, I'll explain it one more time. Kingsgrave and the Vale have hey, a contract. Will. The contract was contracted from me, myself, I was there. Uh, Evelyn was there, Tomas was there, and the people of Kingsgrave. Now the contract says, the Vale will give up one purple horse that will be able to be bred with. Now with that, that horse and the horses that come after her, they cannot, and I mean, they may not sell any of those purple horses that they breed. If so, there will be an issue between us. Okay. No one is allowed to leave with those horses, even if they want the horse and then decide to leave King Grave and they say, oh, well, it's under my tag. No, it's not how it works. Because even though it's under your tag, under contract, that horse still belongs to King's Grave and only King's Grave take their horse so only they can have them and it's strictly for them to ride but now could they breed horses for means. us since it's our contract <laughs> they can but that's not what we agreed upon and I'm really good friends with them but since they did that and they know and mm -hmm. everyone you are really, really good okay. friends with them you're good friends, we're friends with them, you know, the Veil in general, all of us here at the sitting table are really good friends with them. Is that better, Miss Cassandra? Yes. Alright. Now, 
they have the horse and they said they would happily give us the horse so that we can breed and get a baby out of it and hopefully it's a girl so then we can there and we can start <laughs> new breeding line did you see the very beginning of it where we were playing magical so chairs or musical chairs i mean evelyn and tomas is with them they can't do anything about them they can't be upset because it's ours and actually i have to go arrest one of them why to be arrested oh, you should. Uh, I'll highlight it. The veil. With that contract, they also had to pay us 30 gold to be able to receive that horse. But they took that gold for themselves while the contract is, contra is contracted. I under think the they veil did. They um, veil. Not, their names are not on it. Says the veil. So then Reddit. the money should have gone immediately into the. Lord's I don't want to talk over them. I'm, so I'm exactly. breaking up what I'm saying. I don't believe it did, and I believe they kept it. Which is why I must go arrest one of them and bring him back and let that 30 gold, one you left and stole the gold, one supposed to be the Lord's gold, that transaction. So, if not. Then you get to make the decision, Cassandra, of what happens. I just think that... It's just me thinking out loud. I don't think we should pursue them or try to arrest them. I think we should let them cut their ties and move on. I understand, but we need that Lord's go because it belongs to us. You cannot just take it. <laughs> Yes, but don't we get I Lord's know. Gold every week? Yes. Uh, and yes. I don't believe Uncle don't Jasper know. went to go and get the Lord's Gold for this week. Right, no, he's not. In fact, actually, that reminds me, Cassandra, I have to show you where the Lord's Gold is kept, if you don't know. I kind of saw it already. Okay, good. I don't. I don't. <laughs> That's fine. I that's, you don't need. I, don't I think anyone okay, in here fine. can be trusted that's with fine. where it is. Honestly, the people he trusted the most, after all. I will let after you the meeting, secret. I'll show you. I do not want to know now. <laughs> okay. Well, fine. <laughs> anyway, <laughs> I agree with. Uh, I agree with Cass. I don't think we need to be pursuing. Tomas and Evelyn, just bring more pain to the veil. Right now, we need to focus our efforts on rebuilding. And of course, finding Jasper. What good is going to come of us taking 30 gold from people when we get, what, 200 a week? So, Still what you so. missed out on, Will, was that... It adds they're... up, but, if you think about it, they're just going to lash out at us. They're going to tell everybody that we're money grubbing ass hats. I mean I'm sure they already say some pretty foul things because they were removed from their stewardships. We don't need to give the veil a bad reputation. Well <laughs> Hi just me, thank you for the don't. follow and welcome to the night I don't crew. Want to pursue them. I want to we'll just let them, them cut ties. Alright, then if that's what you wish Move my lady that's what happened. Understood. Cut ties and we will not pursue after the gold. There's the alert. Person that wants back. If they that. come to uh, cause issues, that's a different story. But as far as I'm concerned, we are not going to initiate any. Okay. Second matter. The matter of Stoneward, which is below us. As we talked about on our trip back or to King's Landing, you said to let it go and move on. Correct? If something else comes up according to that, then we can deal with it then. But She has poo on her face. They've already apologized. Just move on and let it be in the past. To lift banishment that I put upon them. I did not. I said clear that they are not allowed to visit us. Allowed to visit. Lord Jasper knew of this and he agreed. 
that's what, what's happening. They are still not allowed. Also, they're still allowed to visit no. them. Well, they're still out. One of the things that we were planning before you vanished that, was a to visit them? was a Lord's Day where can, people of the could show their appreciation us, for the uh, for the Lord. Oh, okay. uh, we can't visit them. Which if they can't visit us. You played. But I visited them so, and they were fine with that. So... Yeah. Okay. There. That's the problem. That's see. Let me explain to you. I made that claim. What the day of that little fight I guess the second fight that they had and Ev I told Evelyn specifically and I was supposed to put a note in everyone's um mailbox but I had a giant storm in my head and blew out all my firepower so I was not able to wake up for hours. I screwed everything up. So they were not supposed to come up. Now, I wish Evelyn would have said something like I told her to tell them they are not allowed to be here. Come up, tell them they have to leave because at this current time they're not allowed in the veil. That was only to that was only until we could figure out what's going on. I'll highlight the whole uh, meeting for you. So you can see the very beginning of it, the part that you missed. Those two could have still been here, and we would not have had that giant issue. With Lord Jasper, they got kidnapped. Maybe that they could that maybe that would have. It might seem maybe cold, but I almost don't like. I I think. Them leaving? I think that was good. Yeah, no problem. As much as I, I like them and as, like... as great as they were with the animals, I think that they just they had a little bit too much power and I think it went to their head. Very possible. And I understand where you're coming from. Yeah. Now, do you wish to remove that proclaim, that proclamation? We are not allowed to visit them, and they are not allowed to visit us. Would you like to remove? I would. I would like right. to move past all of that. Okay, then there it is. I will write notes for everyone from everyone's mailbox to let them know we're just allowed to visit us, and we are again allowed to visit them. Since I get along with them so well, if you'd like, I can take a letter to them telling them that the ban is lifted as well. If need be. No, I don't even think they- I don't even think they knew there was a ban because Evelyn didn't tell them. Oh, okay. So, for all we know, they- they might not even know. But do we understand- also, I wanted to understand, do we understand why I put that out, though? Why I put up the, uh, banishment? No. The reason I did that is because I wanted to wait until Jasper had awoke and that he could understand what was going on so that those, so if they came back to apologize, which is they did, and I didn't know, and I figured that Tomas was a hothead after that situation, I didn't know what was going to happen, so I said, and I did that because I did not want to have any further problems with him. I was trying to prevent that second escalation that happened, fortunately told her to it the fight the verbal fight happened again that fight was scary anyway so, so that's why I put that up there stand now I was trying to prevent further conflict Does that make sense? Makes sense. Um. Uh. Well, we, as everyone knows, we are really low. Our citizenship has declined immensely lately. We added people, but people have also left. Plenty of people have left. We need to recruit. I suggest putting it out on the billboard uh, on the way up to the veil, letting uh, people know that we're accepting people. Yeah, it really we is. Also need to discuss what we needed this. We... Mm -hmm. well, I'm sure Jasper kept not... notes on who we have. Oops, sorry. And we'll have to search his uh, books to see. But. 
um, right now, what we are in need of is more than just two stable hands. You guys are great, but you know, I don't think two is enough to help out with all that needs to happen. We Especially also with need us. another builder. What happened to Syria? I've not seen it. I saw him the other day. I mean, um, yes, the day before last, I saw him. Oh. Now we need more than one. Also, no. Uncle Thank Jasper you. was the only farmer, wasn't he? Mm -hmm. Yeah, like I, I think he was. Rose is a cook, I believe. Rose is liable to wake up. So... Well, I guess we'll need another cook. More stable hand. Farmer. And we need another blacksmith. Uh, Natalia has not awakened in days. I don't know where she's been, so... Sorry, I don't know she's my girlfriend. But the veil comes before any of... She is not awoken sometime. Things need to be done. Sirio needs stuff when he is. He can't get them because of blacksmith. She's not here to make them. So we need to find one of those. More night. It's we've been needing for some time now. I haven't been able to find any cells or take. The night we open. mind, we like only have six slots. Right now, we only have. How many are we citizens are we allowed to hold here? Twenty, I believe. You <laughs> have a jet engine in the background. Still at twenty. I thought twenty-five by now. Lyra is on a laptop, so what you're hearing is her fan. 25? It's still at 25. It's 25 now? Oh, nice. I don't know that in character. I don't know a way of translating that in character. I think we should prioritize getting... Hmm. Well, what more needs to Actually, be built? I mean... Um, we don't need another builder right now, so that's not really a huge priority. But, like... In the future, I would like to and get rid of some of the arches that are in the stable. They're pretty, but I'm. Well, you said uh, I, I, I completely agree. You said we have how many slots? Six. Six. Well, she believes six, but I. Will oh, in in total. Five, but we have fourteen. Seven. Oh. Um, I, I believe we can only have 20. All right, I'm going to pull a little bit of bullshit. So, with um, what we have right now. The Lord of Light is telling me it's 25. It's 25 now, so we have 11. <laughs> That's a lot of slots to fill. With, um, uh, Cassandra, do you know what's <laughs> going on, um, beyond the wall? Yes. <laughs> Nailed it. <laughs> Don't. When I went to the Night's Watch to tell them about Jasper, I overheard the first <laughs> steward telling, I, I think it's Daniel, I don't know, it's the really loud mouthy kid. I told, or overheard him saying that the Night King is active. That means we'll be dealing with not only Jasper's disappearance and uh, obvious political unrest, but we will be dealing with White Walkers. Aw, I'm glad. As the saying goes in Winterfell, winter's coming. We need blacksmiths to make ballistas. 
We <laughs> need knights to keep us safe, and maybe some more hunters for range support. Use with another uh, stable hand to help Sage and I get defensive mm -hmm. creatures up and going. Yes, completely I, agreed. I have. Oh, oh that man, I want to talk to you. Just stable hand. I've tried to convince him. Beer. It's very stern on sitting there, especially after the death of one of my colleagues. Charlie. His sister. Understandable. Um, also must watch and we do need to keep in mind everybody that we, we allow in. If you have a bad feeling about them, then they might not be a good fit. Lyra and I can, are, are a pretty good judge of character, each of us. I'm sure you all are as well. <laughs> Just kind he of did, look. He will seek me out tomorrow. He has a friend. Say that is one. Blacksmith, so we'd have to take both. Coral, you're cutting in and out again. I don't know why I'm cutting in and out. My stupid uh, throat is pissing me off. Was that better? Ow. Ow. It's like, heard you loud and clear. Your voice. Oh. Okay, as long as you heard me loud and clear. We have a bla we might have a blacksmith and another stable hand coming. I talked to the to the guy I want to go talk to earlier. Um, he won't leave, but he has friends that might need plate that need a place and. One is a blacksmith, one is a stable hand, so I will be meeting with them tomorrow sometime. And hopefully, uh, we'll be getting them to move here. I'll judge them, of course, of character. Um, if Sage is awake, Sage can help me. If Cassandra's awake, Cassandra no, can help loud. me. Or even Lyra or Orpheus. Either one of you would yeah. be great to help me evaluate these two to determine if they'd even be good enough to be willing to. If they'll be good enough to let them stay. Mm -hmm. We have that, but we'll need to find more people. Funny how everyone moves their mic inside their mouth when there is a complaint about not being able to hear them. Yeah, this is just a, a thing people do for some uh, reason. Some point tomorrow. Yeah, I agree. Well, he's sleep. I'm very tired, but. He's been a lot of fun to roleplay with. I will with. go out and scout and talk to people and see if there's anybody living uh, out on their own. See if they want to come up here. We can evaluate them as a group, of course. Of course, yeah. That works. The last thing that we need to speak about is Charlie Baratheon. I'm not sure if you guys all know, but he is still alive. Yep. Yeah, well aware. Saw him with my own eyes. Survived the veil. I don't know who Ow. this is. You don't know Charlie? I've never met, I've never met the man myself. Nope. Never met him. Never he seen him. King. I've heard of him. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Just gonna leave it like that so you get a nice good view of it. Just hovering there. Yeah. Also, my family their name. I only know what I've been told about him. Oh, it despawned. I and so have I. Don't know exactly uh, what connection he had to the veil other than Jasper and him being party, which is we still are. But he's on a rampage since. His son was. Of course. The guy's sister that died, Charlie, is the one that killed her. Yeah. 
Which Charlie? Charlie Baratheon or Charlie? All right. What does this have to do with us? I don't know what he's thinking exactly. Before Jasper disappeared, he said that he would never come back up to the Vale, according to Lyra. Chocolate thing on her head. But with his recent loss. You talking about the son, hovering poop I that was there a moment ago? Clearly, murders rampage and now. He threatened everyone now. I don't know if he will come to the veil or not, and we have our eyes open all the time. Well, then he we made a promise to Jasper that he would never come back here, and that Jasper was not involved in any of that. The only people he would go after, I imagine, would be people involved in what happened to Tysinian. The veil has yes, always been but, neutral. Yes, but this girl it had nothing to do neutral. with Tysinian. She was murdered in cold blood for absolutely no reason. Do we have witnesses? Do we know that he is definitely the one that did it then? He left. The there was no. But anybody um, who knows about that list could forge it. So there's no actual proof. Well, I mean, I agree with that. keeping our eyes that. open, and Just we should be on our guard. You have a right to not trust him. As a Vale steward and as the head knight of the Vale, your job is to be suspicious around. Although, I am going to say this. I don't see what Charlie Baratheon has to do with us. He made a promise to my uncle, and I'm going to only assume that he keep it. Well, I'll let you assume that, and I will assume that he will not keep it. I will keep my head really high like the book. Dares to show then his do head. so, and I appreciate how dedicated you are. Is there anything else? I believe that's all I have tell you guys currently unless you want to know um, more about char or Tysanian's execution I, I don't think I can handle hearing it well I have nothing else unless you have something for uh, the only thing I have to bring up is um, Cassandra would you like me to serve under you as a steward as well? I was planning to serve under Jasper, but things happened. Um, could I have more than three? I'm gonna read that word for word in a moment. Coro and Sage are one. Currently we have four. Ah, you have four? four. <laughs> yes. Who else? He's Sage, Valor. We only have three. Then I will just take the position of ranger captain. Does that work? I mean, there's only three uh, stewards, but I'm not sure if we can have more than three. Give me one second, give me a second. Is Valik no longer yeah. a uh, steward? Uh, temporarily, he's not. Oh, well, all right. And, yeah. He's, because I, I assume he's going to be gone for a while. Orpheus? Orpheus, relax. Relax. The fire. Well, the fire. The flames Wait, whisper. Might be speaking to the, the Lord of whisper. They tell me your uncle's spirit still lives and is very much intact. Boom! Look at how quiet the room got. Tell you anything that is all I hear. Well, that's good news. At least there's something good out of all this. <laughs> I 
I shall also be looking uh, for Lord Jasper tomorrow. I will be setting out on um, go north to find him. Even if I have to scale um. the wall, we'll do what I need to do. <laughs> Koro. Yes. Don't scale the wall. Just go to the Night's Watch. They will let you through. I'm gonna find Jasper too. So having extra hands, you know, I'm sure they'll appreciate it. I was thinking about going myself tomorrow. See, when they said don't scale the wall, I was gonna say, I'm pretty sure they have an elevator. Well, one of us needs to always be here, so I'm gone and up there. Well, we can't always alternate. Here. Well, yeah, yeah, yeah. I was gonna say we can always switch. If I'm gone, I would like you to stay, and if you're gone, I will stay. I can do that. Cassandra, to be as protected as she can. Well, I'll be between here and King's Grave. I want to help Aunt Allie for my birthday. Okay, that's fine. As long as you stay close to her, I have no problem with that. No problem. <laughs> And if you ever need, I can escort you to places if Cora was not awake. Is that everything I'm tired? Yeah, that is everything. Oh. That is I have one last thing. Can I throw a small I party here for- thing. Oh, go ahead, Orpheus. You mentioned how you believe Charlie Baratheon could be a threat. Yes. The woman who came here earlier asking for medical attention resides in the Iron Isles. The Iron Isles is the only place the Crown does not have authority. I believe that's where he's hiding. I'm supposed to go meet with her at some point to inform her of what I find for uh, for her medical ailment. While I'm there, I could poke around to see if I can find him and see if he's an actual threat. I'm going with you. No, you're not. No, you're not. There is no way I'm letting Orpheus go to the Iron Isles without me. Yes, that's what Orpheus is going. I don't believe that they will. I'm not sure how they'll react to something that's not Jasper. Ladies, Orpheus. How that will go either, consider. Like Red Priest. Or... Well, they react. I can go well, with Orpheus. I'm tired. I'm going to bed. <laughs> Good night, Cass. Good night. Good night. Cora, Good night. get up. Ooh, old. I do know some people now that I'm friends with. I might be with you. Good night. She's gonna come over and Good try and give me a hug. <laughs> Ooh. Good night. Oh wow, she like. Okay, so... I hate headaches. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, Orpheus, if uh, I need you to be very careful if you do go. I can't control if you go or not. Your red priest with you. <laughs> Just to go, you go. Not nah, for that. But I don't know how they react. They They'll try to reality. drown him. That's why I'm gonna have to make him a disguise so I can make him some gilly. I'd say he could just take the mask off and wear some other clothes, but um That's it's not very an option. He's a red That's not I, I know. Can you at least color your mask? That mask is very obviously a priest mask. Yeah. So I'll make him a ghillie mask instead. Hmm. 
And the ghillie should cover enough. Mm -hmm. I have the a ghillie suit she made him. already. I just, I don't feel safe with him just going by himself. And if you're here to watch over Cassandra, I don't see a problem with it, especially if we're sussing out a threat to the kingdom. I have to go to Bell Telkin. I am so proud of her. Then, uh, sorry about that. I have to go to bed. Tell Kitten, I'm so proud of this. I'm so proud. This is amazing. Sorry, the, the lack of a comma was like throwing me off a little bit. I'm so happy to see this. Thank you, David. No. It's no problem. And thank so. you for stopping in. And thank you for being the uh, Lord of the Veil. Vale. Because you did an amazing job with the place. You really okay, did. Sorry, I was in my head. What did you say? What did we say? I'm being defiant and bratty. I said... Honestly, you know... Okay, here's how I'll put it. Remember earlier when you said you were going beyond the wall no matter what? Yes. And yes. I gave you those arrows? Same thing right. with me and uh -huh. following around Orpheus and protecting him. Even if Orpheus died, he would just come back. If another priest brought him back... He can't bring himself will. back. That's how it no, works. He cannot, he cannot bring himself back. Sage knows someone that can. Either way, I yeah, but I don't know if she'll be awake tomorrow. And I don't want anything to happen to Orpheus anyway. I don't want anything to happen to Orpheus either. So if and you wish to follow I, her, I can't stop you from sleep. I know. And I won't leave Cassandra by herself. I won't leave until I know you're awake. But what, listen, Orpheus? I think I have a little bit. I think Here Orpheus and I both have yeah. an advantage with sussing out if Charlie is a threat. If he is there, I don't wish to do anything else but to inform me. Or, in fact, if better, go inform King's Landing as soon as possible. Alright. Tell them to make you anonymous. No matter what, don't let them know how you... Tell them you know you're there, you saw him, and to tell them to keep you... Not to even say your name, not even to say where you're from or anything. Say that there's a witness that saw you there. Sorry. Just wish to keep you guys safe, that's all. No. He cares. I know, Did I know? <laughs> Maybe he's getting soft in his old age. Not old. Never will I be soft. <laughs> I, soft. I think you're a little soft. Yeah, need to... I will chop someone's head off in an instinct. Don't. <laughs> Test me. I like my head attached, so I don't want you to chop it off. Well, I'm not gonna chop your head off, but anyone else's I'll chop off. <laughs> Alright. <sighs> anyway, I don't think we have anything else to really talk about, do we? I think we have everything pretty much planned. We keep searching yeah, for Jack, so. sir. He's clearly alive. Remember. We have a week and a half to find them, though. That is our time limit. Mm -hmm. Sage bred me some really nice dogs. I can use them. I'll give them the hat and let them try to track him. Get his scent off of the hat, perhaps. We can bring them along when we go north of the wall, or when I go. I still need to get you one more. Do 
think I'm gonna have to keep them down by the blood gate. When I tried to bring them down, they fell off. It was a whole ordeal. Yeah, they sometimes just pounce and fall off. Yeah. And this is a great roleplay. <sighs> Alright. Anything else, Coral? I really, really want to go just get some sleep. I'm tired. Nope, because I'm going to bed. Oh, wow, I didn't right. even realize how late it was. Good night. No, that's Good it. Night. We're done. Everyone leave. Good night. Get up and leave. Get up and leave. Get up and leave. Meeting adjourned. <laughs> I, you think you're going to stay behind? And meet about you. That's it. I might be with you. What are we gonna do about that raptor that's down there? There's raptors. It's text says for. Adela from Dulon. Whoa, hey, hey, whoa, hey, wait! Koro! Hey, hey. What? You said, what do we do about it? I was, I made a solution. If they're not coming back for it, no. Keep so what it. What do we do with it? I don't know, I could, I, how many, one, two, I'd take it if I had a room. I don't have a room. Huh. Who neutered it? Uh, it's, um, a line from Dulant from the Timberland. Yeah, they did neuter hers. Unfortunately, they don't have the option to, uh... Hey, crap, you're down to this. I'm just curious. Did they? Did they? No. I need to name that thing. It can't just be named for Orpheus 5 uh. Maester was using my uh, beaver, apparently. The beaver P gave me, so it's free to use it. This is what I wanted to show you. All those seeds. <laughs> That's from 10 minutes. All of those can be used to make uh, potions that I need. What am I going to do with your... This, what am I gonna do with you, guy? Let's see. Uh, let's see if I can bring this up to a thousand. Uh, nailed it. Let's see how much you get from this. Yeah. Training up the berry picker. Mm-hmm. Made it a bit more uh, resilient, just in case it needs it. Hmm. What? We're gonna talk to Charlie. I don't care who calls. Excuse you. I believe that murder for a second. You.
I'm not sure. I have to ask. I might be able to make something that makes him tell the truth. You probably wake up a truth serum. If you are a uh, man of medicine. What happened with that girl? Was she sick? She was, but she isn't any longer. Her illness left her with scars, and she wishes these scars to be hidden. Oh, I see. That is all. Are you heading to bed? I probably should. They've been rather long and draining. I'm gonna... I hate you. Good night, Orpheus. Good night. Good night. And also with you. Hi there! She's actually giving me this, so I need to rename it. No. Come on, Gerald. We're gonna go to sleep. grown in. Right. Let's see who is uh who is streaming. Refresh this page. Oh, well, there's only one other person streaming. All right. I know who I'm hosting then. If my uh, bot cooperates. Thank you. Good night. I am going to host... Smile Witch Doctor? Miss Witch Doctor... Okay. Invalid username. All right, I'm going to have to just go to the actual website and get the name that way. That's going to take me a little bit, but... We had quite a few res uh, revelations. We've had um, we had a, a pretty full day, I would say. You know, um, finding out about Jasper, finding about Tysinian, making plans to finally go to the goddamn Iron Isles, and uh, my plan is kind of out there now a little bit, but. We will do what we can about that. Alright. Uh... Come on. Load a little bit faster. I'm actually very curious what's going to happen when I meet uh, Charlie for the first time as uh, Orpheus. If he's going to recognize Orpheus at all, or if um, he's going to try and drown him because he's a red priest, or if he's going to be like, You help not me. <laughs> so I'm going to do something about that. All right. Only one other person streaming. Oh, come on. There we go. Wait. Alright. Yeah. 
Communities one, nine viewers. All right. Uh, let me get your name. And we're going to host you. Hey, kitten. I'm about to host someone. You sexy topless orf. <laughs> uh, am I streaming tomorrow? Yes. Yes, I am. I don't know exactly what time tomorrow, but I will be streaming tomorrow. But thank you all for watching. And I guess I'll see you tomorrow. Have fun. And make sure you bug this other streamer, Tom. You know, just show a little bit of love to them. <laughs>